Hi everyone and welcome. My name is Thomas and I'm here with my training partners Ryan and Shay and today we're going to take you to a full body session powered by Galland. Today's session we're aiming to engage as many muscle groups as possible and equally we're looking to burn as many calories as possible. I'm going to take you through a warm up first and some mobility just to make sure those joints are nice and loose, nice and juicy and your muscles are stretched out and warm getting you ready for this workout. Okay, so we'll jump straight into it. We're going to start with some mobility and we'll start rolling your shoulders forward nice and easy. Just stretching it in, open up that chest. And then from there, we're going to shrug backwards, squeezing those shoulder blades in, rotating backwards and opening up that chest again, nice and proud. And then have a few more on this one. Okay, let's go with the big swings. This time moving forward again. Just making sure those shoulders are ready for today's workout. And then from there, we're going backwards. Another few in four, in three, in two. Good stuff. Okay, bring your feet slightly more apart now. And then just gonna work on your hips now. So from here, you're gonna reach down into your toes and you open up outside of your body from one side to the other. Take it easy, no need to rush anywhere. We're just warming up, just mobilizing those hips, those shoulders. Try to look up to the ceiling. We've got a few more on this one. And we're gonna get into your workouts in five, in four, in three, in two, good stuff. Okay, so get on top of your mats. From here, we're gonna get down to your workout. So feet apart, rolling that chin forward into your workout position, into your cobra stretch. From there, lift yourself back up and give me that workout back up. Nice and easy again, rolling that chin forward. Boom, 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 into your cobra stretch. Squeezing your glutes together. Then lift yourself back up, walk up. We've got two more in there. Chin down, roll into your cobra stretch, stretch your abs out. Then from there, lift yourself back up and give me a last one. This time we're gonna stay in your press up position. From here, world's greatest stretch. Step it in, from here, you open up outside of your body, reach up, look up, and I really want you to sink into those hips. From here, we're switching over to the other side. Now, if you're not flexible enough, that's fine. You can drop the knee onto the floor. And if you are flexible enough, take that knee off. Switch another, step in again, open up. And just really focusing on sitting into those glutes, into those hips. In three, two, one. Walk you back up. Okay, last one for your mobility. Get into your squat position. And from here, plant your hands onto the floor. You're gonna reach out, open up outside of your body. Pause there for a few seconds and you're switching over to the other side again. Just to mobilize those hips properly. Switching over. And again. And come up. Shake it off. Good stuff. Okay, so I should warm up and your mobility done. So we're gonna jump straight into your first section of your main workout. So we've got three exercises. We've got your squat, we've got your lunges, and we've got your stiff leg deadlifts. I'm gonna be working with the barbell, Ryan with the heavier dumbbells. So he's gonna work on the advanced option, and Shay is gonna be working with dumbbells, but the options for beginners. So let's just get into it. Grab onto your weight. I'm gonna start with 40 seconds on your squats. For your squats, I want you to open up those hip flexes. So you're sticking your bum out and just sink into those hips, sinking into those glutes and you're gonna push back up through those heels. In three, in two, and one. We've got 40 seconds on. Let's go. Dropping into your squat, pushing back up. Chest forward, back straight. And just really thinking about your midsection, your core, your glutes, your hips and think about pushing through those heels. Squeezing those shoulder blades in. Good stuff. No need to rush anywhere. Just really thinking about your glutes and your hamstrings. Pushing through those heels. Another five seconds. Then jump straight into your next exercise, which are lunges. Two, one, good stuff. Shake it off. From here, we're gonna step backwards. So, 
It's your reverse lunges. I want you in your 90 degree angle on your front leg. From there, you're gonna switch over. Tucking your pelvis in, switch over. Off you go. 40 seconds on. And again, no need to rush anywhere. Thinking about those squats, hips. Just making sure you're tucking that pelvis in. Everything is engaged, your core, your glutes. I want you in your 90 degree angle. I'm gonna push through those heels. We're almost there now. Few more seconds, then we go one more exercise for your legs. That's gonna be your stiff leg deadlifts. And that one we're gonna focus on your hamstrings and your glutes. And in 10 seconds, we'll get to it. Good stuff. Chest nice and proud. And in five, in four, in three, and two, and set. Good stuff. Okay, your next exercise and your last one for your legs. Stiff leg deadlifts. Slightly bending your knees. Keep your weight close into that body. Drive your hips back, stretch, stretch, stretch. Now you're hinging your hips back in and squeezing those glutes together. In three, in two, and one. Time is yours, 40 seconds. We drop in, close into our shins. Driving those hips back in. Hips back out, out, out. Push them in and squeeze. Good stuff. We're almost there now. Halfway through our last exercise in our first lower body round. 20 seconds to go. Control that breathing. Shooting those hips in. Squeezing those glutes together. We're almost there guys, stay strong. Open up that chest. Shoot it back in and we've got last 10. And I'm gonna reward you with 20 seconds. Rest period after this in five, in four, in three, in two, and you can drop your weights down, shake it off. Well done, you've got 20 seconds, so use it well. If you need a quick water break, go for it. 10 seconds now, you know your exercises. We're gonna do one more round. We're gonna jump straight into your squats again. So Ryan will rack you onto his shoulders. This time, Shay, we're gonna hold one dumbbell and you're just sinking into those hips. Right, get ready for it. In three, in two, and one. Let's go. Slow and controlled sitting into it and driving through those heels back up. I want explosive squat back up. Good stuff. Almost there. We're halfway through now. 20 more seconds to go. Just making sure you control your breathing. Five seconds left. You know your next exercise, we're jumping straight into it in three, in two, and one. Good stuff, let's get into your lunges now. Reverse lunges, 90 degrees on your front leg. You're switching over, tucking your pelvis in. Engaging those glutes. Your hamstrings are working, your core is engaged. And again, no need to rush, slow and controlled. Good stuff. We're halfway through now. Sitting into it, switching over. 10 seconds left. And you know your last exercise. Stiff leg deadlifts again. In five, four, three, two, time. Good stuff. Right, let's get into it. No rest. Stiff leg deadlifts, you've got 40 seconds on. Remember, slightly bending those knees, driving your hips back. Let your hips do all the talking, all the work. In three, two, one, all yours, off you go. Drive, 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 use those hips. Shoot it back in, and we're going again. Good stuff, controlling your breathing. Knees out, back in. Knees out, back in. We're almost there, halfway through now, halfway through. Keep pushing, and we've got 20 seconds rest after this one. Seven seconds to go. Six, five, four, three, two, and 
side, recover. Well done, well done, well done. Okay, shake it off. And again, 20 seconds rest. Quick water break if you need to. We're jumping into your second section. We've got four exercises this time. We've got your pull exercise. Bend over rows. We've got your push exercise, push press. We've got your pull exercise after that. Upright rows. And we're gonna finish this off on your mat with a chest press. Right, get ready. In four, in three, in two, and one. Let's work. Grab onto your weight. You've got your barbells. We're gonna get into your underhand grip. Same position and as your stiff leg that is bend your knees, drive your hips back. Squeezing at the top. Just really thinking about pulling those elbows into your hips. Good stuff. 20 seconds. Keeping in control, squeezing those shoulder blades in. Perfect. Good stuff. As you see, Shay is doing the beginner's version. If you're struggling with the heavy weight, grab onto one weight. That's totally fine. Just making sure you're squeezing those shoulder blades in. Almost there. You've got five more seconds. You've got your push press coming up. In four, in three, in two. Good stuff. Okay. Straight into it. Elbows are tucked in. Soft knees. Core is engaged from there. Press. Lock. Back in. In three, two, one. All yours. Press, lock, slowly back down. Using those hips. Using those elbows. Halfway through now. Got 20 more to go. We're gonna go back into your row exercise, which will be, which will be upright rows. Hitting those shoulders. Almost there now, you've got five seconds. Four, three, two, don't drop your weight. From there, we're gonna straight into the next one. Upright rows. Driving through your elbows, squeezing at the top. Chest nice and proud. Squeezing at the top, perfect. Give me a few reps on those. We've got one more exercise into your chest after that. Good stuff, and again, Shay's doing your beginner version. Ryan's doing your advanced version. In both exercises, we're really focusing on squeezing those shoulder blades in, open up that chest. You're working your traps, you're working your real delts, you're engaging that core. And you've got last five seconds, then we're gonna drop down to your mat. In four, three, two, well done. Good stuff, guys. Perfect. Okay, we've got one more exercise into your chest press. Grab onto your dumbbells. This time, I just want you to relax your back onto that floor, relax your head. You're gonna go nice and wide, just tapping those elbows onto the floor, squeezing at the top in three, two, one, off you go. Into that chest, just tapping those elbows, squeezing at the top. You're punching the weight back up. Good stuff. Nice and relaxed, focusing on your chest. Focusing on your tricep. Squeezing at the top. Stay with it. You've got 10 more seconds. And we're gonna take a little break. 20 seconds again. And we've got second round coming up in four, three, two, punch, and well done. Good stuff, okay, recover. Have a drink, have a water break if you want to. You know your four exercises. So we've got your pull, push, pull, push. We're gonna 10 seconds to rest, and then we're going again with your first exercise, your bend over rows. Five seconds, four seconds, three seconds, two, all yours. Remember, if you've got those barbells, underhand grip from your knees into your hips, and you're squeezing at the top. Shoulder blades, chest forward. Control, controlling that breathing. We're halfway now, 20 more to go. Squeezing, dropping back down. Squeezing, dropping back down. 10 seconds, stay with me. We've got five, four, three, two, 
and set. We've got your second exercise, we've got your push press. I'm starting feeling it now. Getting a little bit sweaty on this one. Right, let's go. Onto your weight. Two, one, and press for Eon. Soft knees, core tight. Use those hips if you feel like the weight's getting a little bit heavy. Use your body weight. Just slightly dip into it. Push and squeeze. Stay with it. 10 more seconds. We're almost there. Five more seconds. Four, three, two. Good stuff. Pull exercise again. We've got upright rows. This time you're driving through your elbows and you're squeezing at the top. Right, ready? Ready? In three, two, one. Off you go. Close grip. Elbows out. Squeezing. Open up that chest. Nice. Halfway through now. Halfway through. Stay strong on this one. Squeeze in. Let's add a little extra. We'll bring it up and hold it in three, two, one. Let's hold it there for five seconds. Open up that chest. We got five. We got four. Three, two. Yes. Drop down. Shake it off. All good. All good. <laughs> okay. Right. Last exercise in your second section. Let's go into it. Onto your chest. Into your chest press. And again, just tapping those elbows off the floor, squeezing at the top. And time is all yours. Squeeze, drop, tap and squeeze. Just relax everything else. Nothing else matters right now. Just focusing on pushing and punching that weight up. Almost there. You got 10 more seconds on this one. And again, I'm gonna reward you with a bit of a rest. And we're gonna finish this off with our last section of our main workout. And as I said at the beginning, that's going to be bicep, tricep, and your chest. And set, well done. Good stuff, everyone. Okay, shake it off, well done. This time we're gonna take 30 seconds. And we've got one more to go. We've got your tricep, your bicep, and then your last one on your abs. Okay, while you're resting, I'm gonna take you through your first exercise. So again, if you've got your barbells, you're gonna get down into your underhand grip, elbows are tucked in, you squeeze at the top, and you're controlling as you're going down. If you've got your dumbbells, you're gonna do exactly the same thing. Elbows are tucked in, you're squeezing at the top, Slowly back down. Now Shay's going to show us the beginner section, the beginner's option. She's going to grab onto one weight only, squeezing at the top, and exactly the same principle, same thing, slowly back down. That's going to be our first exercise. Next exercise, get down to your tricep extension. So we're starting with elbows tucked in again, dropping that whole weight down, pushing through your elbows and your triceps, squeezing at the top. And your last exercise will be your sit ups using your weight. Okay, enough rest now. Let's get to work in three, in two, and one bicep curls. Off you go. 40 seconds on this one, two rounds. And that's us done. Squeezing at the top, dropping slowly down. And again, soft knees. Tuck your pelvis in, engage that core. Good guys. Give me another 10 seconds. You're switching over into your tricep. In seven now. In six, five, four, three, two, and set. Good stuff. Okay, let's switch angles now. Start with your weights up, elbows are tucked in. Squeezing at the top, pushing your weight back up. Keeping your elbows tucked in throughout the whole thing. 40 seconds on this one. Your last exercise will be on the floor. 
into your abs using your weight also. Squeeze. That was tucked in. David e. We're almost there now. 20 seconds. 15. 10 seconds. Stay with it for five, four, three, two, and time. Good stuff, everyone. Okay, let's bring it down to your mats. Make sure you've got your weights ready. Okay, from there, we're gonna get into your sit up position. As you're coming up, I want you to push your weight above your head. And again, Shay is gonna show us the beginner version. Ryan's gonna go for the advanced version, okay? Get ready. In three, in two, and one. Time is all yours. You press over your head, keeping that core nice and tight. Good stuff. Come on, you got it. A few more. Good stuff. And if you feel like this exercise is getting a little bit too hard, that's fine. Just drop your weight. Do what you can. Five more seconds. Four, three, two, and recover. Good stuff. Well done. How are you feeling? <laughs> I can tell they're feeling it. Okay, we're gonna take a little rest. We've got one more round. This round is the most important one, your final one. I want you to give me everything you got. Maximum effort. We're gonna smash it on this one, and that's us done. Okay? Right, another 10 seconds rest. Then we're going straight into it. If you find, get onto your feet. And you know your first exercise, bicep curls. In four, three, two. Time is all yours. Let's go. Squeeze. Dropping slowly now. Keeping it controlled. If at some point you feel like you can't do it anymore, that's fine. Drop your weight, shake it off. When you're ready, come back into it. Good stuff. We're halfway. 20 more to go. Ten seconds left now. Five seconds. Good work, guys. Two. One. Okay. Drop the weights down. Shake it off real quick. Tricep. Weight up. Elbows tucked in. In three, in two, and one. Off you go. Squeezing at the top. Elbows are tucked in. If you're struggling with the balance, totally fine. Just step forward with one foot. Working on your coordination. Core is engaged. We're almost there now, guys. 10 seconds. We're gonna finish this with your last exercise, your sit-ups into a press in four, three, two. Good stuff. Okay, last one to finish this off. And that's it. Onto your mat, onto your back. If you can't do it with board weight, totally fine. As long as you're doing this exercise, that's all I want from you. Right, in three, in two, and one. All yours, off you go, 40 seconds. Last 40 seconds. Try to give me as many reps as you can. Really want you to push yourself on this one. <sighs> 20 seconds, we're halfway. <sighs> 10 seconds, few more in there. Come on, Ryan, come on, Shay. Few more, four. Three, two, and time. Good stuff. Well done, well done, well done. Okay, you don't need to go anywhere. You can stay on your mat. I'm gonna do a quick stretch, quick cool down before we go. And that's you done for today. Okay, so first things first, relax your whole body. Just lay back, take a deep breath. From here, I want you to bring your left knee into your chest and just pull it slightly. Control your breathing. From there, 
same leg. We're gonna extend it now up to the ceiling and then push. You're stretching your hamstrings. In four, in three, in two. We're switching over. Right knee into your chest. Four. Now leg up to the ceiling. Pull again. Give another five seconds. Four, three, two. Relax. Okay, from here. I want you to get onto your front. You're gonna get into your cobra stretch. Just to stretch those abs out, especially after your lance exercise. So open up, squeeze those glutes together. And we're looking up to the ceiling. Just really want a big stretch now. And five seconds. Four, three, two. Downward dog from there. So drive your hips up. I'm straight, we're looking down. If you're not flexible enough, that's fine. You can bend your knees. Just making sure you're sticking your hips up to the ceiling and your arms are stretched out. In four, three, two. Okay, slowly walk your way up. Feet apart. We're gonna stretch up to the ceiling. Get onto your toes. Stretch those calves out. From here, we're swinging into your left side. So you're stretching your obliques, arms and shoulders. Five seconds, then we switch it over in four, three, two. Switch over to the other side. And again, long stretch. Stretch those obliques, your shoulders, your arms in three, two, one. Down to the center. And just relax everything. Take a deep breath. In three, two, one. Last one, arms across, just push down on your elbow. In three, two, one, switch over. And the last bit, just your wrist. Loosen up everything, shake it all off. Take a deep breath, come up. And that's us done, well done, well done, and well done to you. Once again, this workout is powered by Gallant, and we can't wait to see you again. Take care.